What's up? I am on Rohan and all of that. Give me a second. Hopefully your day is going good. Mine isn't going too bad. I'm gonna move my way to the harder area. Beautiful as you are. Regardless who you are. Beauty that is seen from inside and out. This is what it is all about. Even when some think you are not, it is not their job to judge upon this spot. Being who you are is more important as far as being beautiful as that goes. Beauty is more than what the eyes see, it is shown.
judging against something that is not real. Fake shadow. Shade. Is that real? Or is it Photoshop? Is that the deal? Why compare to one that is not even real? Maybe not even their hair. Fake beauty appeal. Beautiful as you are, no need to use a sh photo program to change such things. Would love to see such things without the changes. Would you still look as good? why I say do not judge yourself against such things for they are showing you things that are not real as far as their sexual appeal Real beauty is one that does not need such things. Sometimes it is unable to be seen. Only by actions and other things can this kind of beauty be seen. But even for ones that it can be seen, Do you love yourself? Are you willing to be yourself? Beautiful as you are. No need to add a beauty scar or other things such as that.
And this can go both ways as well. I'm not talking about just a guy or a girl. It could be either one. Doesn't matter. Uncomfortable with how you look? But then you look at a girl that is in a book or on the screen in front of you and judge yourself against that. Did you ever think not to judge yourself against that? That may be the root of the problem. Beautiful as you are. No need to change a single thing. Well, there would be one that would get in a car and go very far. Just to be seen by the one they got in the car for. They would open their door. Come in and be happy. Or meet somewhere. Regardless where. Even for ones that don't think that they quite meet. There are plenty that would be happy to see. A beauty that you show them or me. Not always appealed by the eye. You can look as good as you want to look. But if you're not the one that is the one that the other one is looking for, then as far as personality goes then it doesn't matter what your figure shows. Even if you try to compare it to ones on TV shows. There are plenty that would like you the way you are.
beautiful as you are, sometimes it is not seen in the same way. From you and me, or to another. Not everyone has the same perspective as far as that goes. It just depends on how your beauty shows. By what you do, maybe by the way people are affected by you. Maybe you giggly and happy all the time. Either way, you are beauty and fine. It's okay looking good, though. Not saying that you shouldn't do that. But you should be happy with the reflection that looks back. Beauty is in the mirror. From your head down to your toes. And everything in between as well. Even your ears and toes. Oh, did I forget about the nose? Maybe the lips and ears as well. Maybe those hips. Maybe the rest. Needless to say, I will not say the rest. I'm sure there's many that will say, mm -mm -mm, they are the best. Beautiful as you are. Even sometimes if you do not think you are.
In one way or another, you are, though. Look at your friends around you. Did you ever notice that they like being around you? That's no a coincidence. Maybe that is providence. That you show a beauty that they are able to see. And they are happy just to be around you or me. A beauty that may or may not be seen for those that are able. You gotta think. Why else would your friends be attracted to you? They see something that maybe you do not. Maybe they see a beauty upon that spot. That is more than what they know or could see. Maybe a beauty that did not know they are not what they see. Or maybe it's because you make them happy in some way or another. You know that's beauty, in one way or another. Do not know the proper word for guys, but pretty much just change the word for that. When you walk in the room, and everyone turns to look to see who walked in the room. When ones just randomly come to you for no reason. Maybe there's beauty that they're attracted. It is not always what you see with your eyes. Interesting thing about your eyes, by the way. Did you know, technically speaking, you see upside down? your brain translates it. When it comes in your eye, it's coming in upside down and your mind flips it. Did you know that? very similar to the concept that your left brain side of the brain controls your right hand and your right side of the brain controls the left. Fascinating, isn't it? The opposite side controls the side that you're moving. If you take your right hand and put it out, it's your left side of the brain that's doing it.
notice that about where you see upside down? Very similar, isn't it? So technically speaking, in that aspect, what is translated in your left eye is actually done on the right side of the brain. At least if you think of it the way that I do. Because you see it upside down, it has to be turned. I may or may not be right about that, but it kind of makes sense to me. to be seen by ones other than yourself. Beautiful as you are, you just don't realize you are. Of course, when you have misinterpretations of beauty, ones that are not actually, truthfully, as beautiful as they show they are, it is kind of hard to see what you should be comparing to. Or I'm pretty sure most of them would not agree to have those pictures not messed with or whatsoever. Some of them would though. Beautiful as you are, there's no need to change anything, no need to be. That way, as far as that goes. that looks like all the time that I have for now. So until next time.